Developing this morning, police arrest dozens of striking hotel workers after things got out of control at a large rally in San Francisco. Well, Force Michael Thomas is in the newsroom with that story. Michael? Uh, hi, everyone. These hotel workers have been striking since September, and last night they decided to stop traffic in downtown San Francisco, leading to 85 of them being arrested. Take a look. This is video from our crew that was there on Powell Street. There was around 2,000 hotel workers and allies that were picketing for a better contract while stopping traffic. 85 of them, as you can see, were arrested, and that was after San Francisco police arrived on the scene and tried to disperse them. Now, this includes workers from Hilton, Hyatt, and Marriott properties. This has been their largest demonstration yet, with workers telling us they want jobs restored that were cut during the pandemic, saying they believe in San Francisco and they know that the city will bounce back. Our, our members are really committed to providing the service and hospitality that people from around the world want to see when they come to San Francisco. So, you know, let's hope the bosses come and do the right thing so that we can get back to work and do what we do best. Workers are also demanding better wages along with more affordable health care. And it's not just here in San Francisco, it's really across the country. Right now, we've seen a total of 10,000 hotel workers going on strike since Labor Day. As we get more details on those that were arrested or if a contract agreement is reached, we'll keep you updated. That's the very latest here in the newsroom. I'm Michael Thomas. I'll send it back to you two live in the studio. All right, Michael. Thank you for that report.